We're continuing our walking tour of Liverpool City Centre to go and find all these Beatles places. Last time we were at the Cardona Cafe. If you haven't caught any of the series so far, then go and check out the, the playlist, which is linked up here. But then let's carry on. So we're in uh, Whitechapel. Let's go and find out what important places are here. So Whitechapel here is uh, quite close to Matthew Street. And we've seen recently Hesse's Music Centre, which is where the Beatles got a lot of their instruments. But here in this building, this used to be Rushworth and Draper, known as Rushworths, a musical instrument shop. These tend to do more of the, uh, the classical instruments, but they also did superb guitars as well. And you've probably seen the photo of John and George taking delivery of their Gibson acoustics from Mr. Rushworth himself. Well, that was inside this building here. This was one of the best musical instrument shops in Liverpool city centre. Um, Brian would often come in here as well to speak to the owners. The Beatles were regular visitors, particularly now that they didn't need finance like they did at Hesse's. They could actually buy their instruments outright. And of course, they used those acoustic guitars on making their first record. So join me next time. It's a very important place in Whitechapel that we're going to go and visit, which is crucial in Beatles history.